Did you know Adam Sandler's first regular Hollywood gig was on The Cosby Show at age 18? He played Theo Huxtable's friend, Smitty, who once briefly dated Denise. But we're getting ahead of ourselves. Let's start at the beginning. Adam Sandler is an American actor, comedian, and writer who was born on September 9, 1966 in Brooklyn, New York. His parents, Judy and Stanley Sandler, were both Jewish and originally from Russia. Sandler grew up in Manchester, New Hampshire, and attended Manchester Central High School, where he was the class clown. After high school, Sandler attended New York University's Tisch School of the Arts, where he graduated with a Bachelor's of Fine Arts degree in 1988. While at NYU, Sandler honed his comedic skills, performing stand-up comedy at local clubs and bars. In 1987, Sandler was discovered by comedian Dennis Miller, who recommended him to Saturday Night Live producer Lauren Michaels. Sandler was hired as a writer for the show and later became a cast member, appearing on the show from 1990 to 1995. During his time on SNL, Sandler became known for his comedic characters, including Opera Man, Cajun Man, and Canteen Boy. He also wrote and performed several popular comedy sketches, including the Hanukkah Song and the Thanksgiving Song. Sandler left SNL in 1995 to pursue a career in film. His first film role was in the 1994 comedy Airheads, in which he played a struggling musician. He went on to star in several successful comedy films, including Billy Madison 1995, Happy Gilmore 1996, and The Waterboy 1998. In addition to acting, Sandler has also worked as a writer and producer on many films. He founded his own production company, Happy Madison Productions, in 1999, which has produced many of his films, as well as other comedies like Grandma's Boy and Just Go With It. Sandler's comedic style is often characterized by his use of juvenile humor and his portrayal of lovable misfits. His films often feature a cast of familiar actors, including Rob Schneider, David Spade, and Kevin James. Despite his success, Sandler has received mixed reviews for his acting abilities. He has been nominated for several Razzie Awards, which recognizes the worst in film, and has won several Golden Raspberry Awards for his performances in films like Jack and Jill and That's My Boy. Outside of his film career, Sandler is known for his philanthropic efforts. He has donated millions of dollars to various charities, including the Boys and Girls Club of America and the Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. In his personal life, Sandler is married to actress Jacqueline Titone, whom he met on the set of the film Big Daddy. The couple has two daughters together, Sadie and Sunny. In recent years, Sandler has continued to work in film, both as an actor and producer. His most recent films include Netflix comedies, The Ridiculous Six 2015, The Do-Over 2016, and Sandy Wexler 2017. Overall, Adam Sandler has had a successful career in comedy, both on television and in film. He has become a recognizable figure in pop culture, known for his unique brand of humor and his portrayal of lovable underdog characters. While he's received his fair share of criticism, he remains one of the most popular and successful comedians of his generation. Thanks for watching The Human Catalog. We hope you enjoyed learning about the life and legacy of Adam Sandler. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more summaries of interesting people and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos. Let us know in the comments which person you'd like us to cover next. See you in the next episode as we continue to explore the human catalog.